wondering what you think about the art style and the way they've the way they've done this. Whether it's pretty close to what you imagine it to be. Yeah, I'll definitely. It's interesting because Fables does have a specific look to it. Um, in that uh, Mark Buckingham, especially in the first part of the series, um, he is the main artist. And he has a very Toad. particular style. Baby. I would say that they do a, like a Fishy pretty good job at oh, rendering no, his... I don't look human. I would it's say what's problem, faithful to his I'll just style the apartment for just a second in to this see what 3D kind of sort of treatment is of it. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to kick up a fuss. I'm looking at a three-foot toad in a sweater. That's a problem. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I don't make the rules. Sorry. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are tied. Right, right. There's too much at stake. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fucking hell! See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place! So... What am I walking into, exactly? A uh, woodsman's on another bender. He's been going on like that for hours. Turn this place to dust if you let him. He's in a fucking rage. Oh! This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. So what set him off? Who knows why it was this time. Man's got a hair trigger. I avoid him as much as possible. When did he start drinking? Not sure he ever stopped. What's a pre-existing engine they use that critic? I didn't know anyone else was up there. Sorry, we just had a comment. Um, Critic69 says if you're reading his comments, so remember that this game is all the more impressively done because it's definitely a pre-existing engine to Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? I knew about video no. game development. Yeah. <laughs> then get the fuck back inside! So if you have any thoughts about things you kind of notice or point out, you know, feel free and, uh... You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? So, uh, we didn't, hey, um, talk anything me? about the farm, um, but the farm is where the fables live who don't look human. Um, and they obviously go there because, you know, if a human saw... If a Mundy saw a talking frog, they'd probably freak out. <laughs> yeah. so we had a stopping point here, so we can, we can talk for a little bit. But, uh, um, you know, we also didn't mention glamours and how they how they work out. I mean, how does that play out in the... Get off of me! Um, so they're on the 13th floor of the big castle in Fableton. There is a... Uh, that's where all the witches live and all the magical characters. And they, in particular... Um, sell their magic. Um, they will help Fable Town when they need that when they need their help. Um, you know, for the greater good, you see them kind of reluctantly give magics out. Um, but if a, uh, you know, three foot toad just wants to look human so they can live in New York City instead of going to the farm, they're gonna charge for it. So uh, they, they mentioned the witches a little bit later. Um, do, are they the only ones that are sanctioned to no, make glamours legally? Is it like is it hey, legal for them to, for other people to make them? No, um, it's just more that all of them really hang out together and they really enjoy the company of other magical user magic people. Um, and only uh, certain like you have to have some sort of inherent magic powers or be using something that is infused with magic in order to do magic in the universe. Um, what about Toad? I mean, what's he like in the, in the novels, and does he, does he appear a lot? 
he does not appear very often and uh he's basically kind of what we saw here uh, the slum lord and kind of just this minor character used to probably at least aggravate big b at the beginning 